Imagine moving into a rental home and then learning a week later you need to move out because you rented it from a scammer. That is what happened to one young couple. They're dealing with it right now. Here's a warning for all renters so you don't waste your money. Dila and Gigi Nadai found the perfect rental home. We even bought our new rug. We got our Wi-Fi turned on. This cute little cottage. We found this apartment on Craigslist, this house. We came and we called the landlord. They told us to meet him over here to look at it. They met the landlord, signed the lease, and paid him a $500 money order deposit. But days after moving in, they got a visit from the real landlord. They were coming here to lock us out. We didn't even know what was going on. Turns out the lease and the rental company were fake. The real owner wanted them out and was turning off their water. The water don't is not, they turned the water off. It's called the house rental scam, and it's getting slicker and slicker. Scammers will find a legitimate house or an apartment for rent. They will repost the ad on Craigslist, give the tenants a phony lease to sign, and take the deposit money. It just feels like we're just lost. I mean, There's nothing we can do. Like they can do nothing, so. That's what it looks like. Dila and Gigi went to the police, but learned they're probably out of luck. Uh, it's a civil situation right now. Uh, I'm hoping that the landlord and the uh, tenants that are currently living there will uh, let them uh, stay there. Our team contacted the owners and a man told us they will now let the couple stay 30 days if they fill out an application and submit a new deposit. But Dila doesn't know if they can afford it now. I don't know what we're gonna do. You know, they got our money. Bottom line, be suspicious of Craigslist rental listings that seem too cheap for the neighborhood and landlords who don't have any keys to the property when you go to look at it.